Welcome back to Chatty Reads. I'm Eric Chatfield, and in this mini lesson, we'll be learning the basic clarinet embouchure and how to make your first sound. Let's dig in. I know what you're thinking. What is this word embouchure? So according to the Merriam-Webster Dictionary, the definition of embouchure is the position and use of the lips, tongue, and teeth in playing a woodwind instrument. There. Now we got our vocabulary word out of the way. We're going to be talking about the basic embouchure and how your outer mouth is formed to make a, your sound on a clarinet. And then we'll get more specific later in a different video on what we do with our oral cavity. So here are four simple steps that you can take almost like a checklist to forming your embouchure for the clarinet. One, tuck your lower lip over your bottom teeth. Second, stretch and flatten out your chin, pointing towards the ground. Next, anchor the top teeth on the ten to the top of the mouthpiece without pinching or biting the reed. Next, bring the corners of the mouth in as well as the upper lip. I like to think of the clarinet embouchure as almost like you're drinking a really thick milkshake that nothing, you can not get anything to come through the straw. And so it's kind of like, it's kind of like that. So as long as you're doing that correctly, you'll be able to produce a nice warm sound. A great way also to practice this at home is take just your barrel, mouthpiece, reed, and ligature. And if you're doing everything correctly, you should be able to make a really clear sound. And then adding the clarinet. Let's review our checklist one more time. First, tuck the lower lip over the bottom teeth. Second, stretch and flatten out your chin, aiming towards the floor. Third, anchor the top teeth to the top of the mouthpiece without biting or pinching. And number four, bring the corners of your mouth in as well as your upper lip, forming a seal around the mouthpiece. A great way to practice this um, is use a mirror. And just make sure you go through each uh, one through four um, of the checklist. And um, in a couple of days or about a week or so, you should start to feel and develop your embouchure muscles and start to develop a very nice, warm, clear tone. That's it for today. So happy practicing. And I look forward to seeing you again.